Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be covering all things Not Scary Farm tickets and other special things. So Tony, how before we get into that, how we uh, how are we feeling today? Feeling good, man. We're kicking off Knots Week, uh, something we've done on the channel many times in the past here on the Knights of Horror, and we're kicking it off with what ticket is best for you? Now, there's a wide variety of tickets at Not Scary Farm. Uh, for those who got the chance to jump on it earlier for the season pass extension of the annual pass for Not Scary Farm, uh, congratulations, you guys are among the very few that can go any night uh, without paying um, some high prices. But nonetheless, I think that this is still going to be a great year. And uh, there's a lot of great ticket options to make that experience even better for you. Uh, kicking it off with our standard tickets. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, go, go for it. Go for it. Go for it. I was All gonna, I was going to say is they start at $59 on select nights and, and, and go up as the season go up. So uh, you could get that. It's your regular general mission ticket. Just gets you in the park. You still have to wait through all the lines, but you still get to enjoy the vibe. Yeah, correct. That's uh, and that's that's the ticket that uh, you know. It's just your bottom base base tier ticket. Um, you're gonna want to buy that uh, before the, the the event, and you don't want to buy it at the gate because at the gate, I believe it'll be a hundred dollars. Yeah, uh, it's usually <laughs> more expensive on depending on yeah. the night. So if like if you buy it online, you save about five six bucks. So no, it's more than that. The gate price is uh, significantly higher. Uh, I don't. I can't pull up what the gate price is. Well, they, well, they tell you when you buy them, like what it would be like online and what it would be on the gate. So yeah, yeah, definitely. So yeah, you want to buy them online. Um, and the uh, our other recommendation is if you are going to be going multiple nights, do it in one transaction because um, you're going to pay less of a service fee because uh, they do charge a service fee um, and taxes on all tickets. Um, so if you're going to be like, just plan your season accordingly. So if you're going to go like two, three, four times, whatever it may be, try to buy them all in one bulk purchase. That way you don't have to pay um, as many service fees because there's like a low rate. And then if you add more, it'll slightly increase with each ticket purchase. Correct. Um, we will talk about a lot of the add-ons uh, later in the video that you can add on to like make your experience even better for Not Scary Farm. For now, we're going to go through all the uh, the ticket event, uh, the ticket ones that you get you in the park and get you all the stuff. And from there, I think the next one we're going to go to is the Fright and Fast Lane. Now, this is a ticket that's basically their front of the line pass for the event. And uh, the cool thing about Knott's version of it is it gives you unlimited priority to uh, uh, all the attractions that are open that night and to all mazes and um, shows. So you get to get like first dibs on seats and stuff, of, of course, in shows. So especially for Puppet Up, you want to sit in that middle row, of course, like near the front. That's usually the best spot to sit at. Um, and you just get front of the line, so you get to beat a lot of the lines, especially getting this ticket on a Saturday night or a Friday night. It's going to be definitely more bang for your buck, honestly, because this is literally – this will get you through everything, and then if you like something, you can go through it again. Like, example, Bloodline and the, and the Grimoire. That is going to be the newest mazes for 2022, and you're going to probably want to go through them multiple times, especially Bloodline if there is multiple areas to go through. Uh, so – Check out the Fright and Fast Line. Sammy, I know we could talk a little bit about that more, too, because we actually have done it one year. Yeah, definitely. We did it last season. Um, just just do note that this uh, the, the price on it, it starts at $135. That doesn't include admission into the park. Um, you do have to pay for admission separately. It is one of the add-ons. Uh, but it is, it's a ticketed one, so that's what we're covering it here. Yeah. Uh, but it's going to get you through, like Tony said, um, all of the attractions that are open, including the mazes. Um, and it's going to make your time uh, pretty nice because um, instead of waiting an hour, hour and a half, two hours for a maze, you're probably going to wait 10 minutes tops. Right. Um, because they're going to obviously pull from the, the Fright and Fast Lane first and then pull a bit from the GA um, and then continue on through that. Um, and so it's going to make your experience more enjoyable, especially on those Saturday nights as you get later into the season um, and Friday nights. Um I would. My recommendation is if you're going on a Thursday or Sunday, especially early in the season, um, if you follow our game plan video, which is coming out later on this week uh, as a part of the Not uh, Scary Farm Week, um, you're probably going to be able to get through everything before the event closes um, with a little bit of time to spare. Um, so uh, we recommend this ticket if you're going Friday or Saturday, um, especially as you hit like the two weekends uh, before Halloween, because those tend to be uh, the most packed nights. Right. Um, and so 
our game plan might not work for those nights because it, it's a, you're going to have to be on your game. Um, if you want to be a little more leisurely, um, you know, maybe grabbing a drink, grabbing some snacks. Um, this is probably the best way to go, so it'll allow you to get through everything. Um, especially if you're only going one night, and you want to go through things multiple times. And if you're one of those coach coaster enthusiasts and you don't have a not stay throughout the regular year, uh, maybe you can ride a couple coasters in there as well. Yeah, we have actually a few people that we know coming down from Florida. Some of our friends that you've seen on the channel and, and their channels and on Boo Bros that are coming down and some of them want to ride the roller coasters as well. So we're trying to figure out what's the best uh, way for them. And, and we've helped them uh, get an idea of what a night's going to be like, especially around the time they're coming out. So basically plan accordingly um, when it, it, if you're going to if you're going to just get a regular general admission. Um, but if you want to guarantee do everything. Um, that's rides and shows and, and mazes. Uh, the Fright and Fast Lane add-on is your best bet. So there's that. Uh, this one, I don't think I, at least if I've never seen it, but the uh, this is something new for um, for the first time ever, I think. Is it, did they Because they didn't do this last year, did they? Um, since I've been back to Not Scary Farm since uh, 2019, I have not seen this ticket option. Yeah. Uh, and I was very intrigued by this option. And if I had more disposable income, yeah. I definitely think we would have done this. But uh, disposable income is limited in the uh, in the uh, Bank of Sam currently. But uh, that is the very important monster to wear. Yeah. Uh, starting at uh, or it's starting at five hundred and forty nine dollars <laughs> a person. Uh, a person. Yeah. Your very important monster tour includes admission during Not Scary Farm, a private guide for up to six hours, general parking, buffet dinner with exclusive monster photo, a scare, and a Not Scary Farm t-shirt. During this time, uh, during the time with your guide, you can also enjoy priority access to select rides and priority show, show seating. So you get to have someone that basically walks you up to all the front of the lines and, and you get the buffet and uh, you get the um, exclusive monster photo and a, and a t-shirt and parking all for uh, starting at $549 based on select nights per person. Um, that is really a good, uh, if you're really only coming down, especially if you're coming down from out of state or vacation and you want to visit, I would say that would be your best bet to do because you really get to experience everything you need to experience in one ticket package. Um, you know, the buffet is great, and we're going to talk a little bit about that a little bit later on in the video, but the buffet is great, um, saves you, uh, you know, includes your parking and your ticket. You get a private guide that walks you around the entire park for most of the event, and then he probably splits off with you towards the, like, last two hours, so you can go off and do whatever you want to do with your by yourself and stuff. So I, that, I think that's really cool, and then, you know, an exclusive, maybe an exclusive T-shirt, so that's really cool. I mean, this is something that is new for uh, the 2022 season. It looks like they're really trying to give the fans the best experience possible at Not Scary Farm when you're there, especially if you're only going the one time too. So, I'm I'm pretty cool with this one. I'm, I'm I I like I like Sammy said, if we had the money, we would do it because this package is amazing. Yeah, yeah, like Tony said it. It is an amazing package, and, and the the fact that you're getting all of those things in there, a private tour. Um, I believe you're getting admission to the park, uh, parking, a, a t-shirt, buffet. There's a lot of great things in there. Um, and then the fact that you're getting a private tour guide, which is really cool. Um, yeah. Someone to take you from place to place, get you in and out of mazes quick, um, get you on attractions if you want to do that. Um, that's really cool. It's a really cool experience. Um, and if you have the money, we, we would say, yeah, go for it. Do it. Um, and let us know how it is because we're really curious. Right. Uh, and in and, and six hours, so uh, assuming they'll be with you from like 6 p.m. till midnight, that's a, that's a good time. Yeah. Um, and then if it's a Friday or Saturday, you have another two hours of freedom if you want it. Or on Thursdays and Sundays, that's another hour. Um, so it's, it's a really cool thing. Um, and it really just gives you the whole uh, the, the VIP experience uh, <laughs> or VIM, very important monster tour. That's cool. um, it it kind of reminds me a lot of what uh, Universal Studios does for uh, Horror Nights. Yeah. Because um, they have like a tour guide uh, option if you, if you buy those tickets as well. Um, so it kind of reminds me a lot of what they're doing um, and, and not just taking it on. Um, and then another new experience, um, if you want to, do you want to get into that now? The other new experience that uh, Knox is doing this season? Yeah, might as well. We can go from there and then we'll do the, the, la the other one last. Go for it. 
So the newest, uh, another new experience that uh, we're, we're talking about now, too, is another add-on that you can get on top of your, your ticket that you buy for Not Scary Form. Or you don't even have to buy a ticket. You could just maybe come just do this and go if you want to. Um, the Not Scary Farm Behind the Fog Tour. Uh, and it goes as follows. Join us for a three-hour lights-on behind-the-scenes look at Knott's Scary Farm. You'll learn the history of Scary Farm and take part in a walking tour of multiple mazes with the lights on. Also included is a 2022 Knott's Scary Farm lanyard and a collectible pin plus light refreshments. So that one, Sammy and I are doing this year for sure. When we saw this option, we were like, it's a no-brainer. We're going to do it. We're, we're, we're fans of the event, and we want to go beyond what we see at night we want to see the lights on the details that we don't get to see going through the maze and, and the easter eggs that we don't get to see going through the maze because we're going so quickly through the maze um so we get to see those details and what makes it good for me and sammy this year is we're going two nights and then kind of taking a break and then going to come back and go our third night and on that third night since we have time to kind of soak all the new mazes in and and everything it will be a lot better for us because now we can go around looking at things that we missed. So we're, we're super stoked for that. Uh, this is another first year thing they're doing. And that is uh, one price, seventy nine ninety nine. no matter what day you go, which I, I think that's cool. Um, and I think that's a really reasonable price. I don't, I, I haven't seen really any other, um, you know, theme parks really do any like something like this so I, i'm really excited to see uh what this has to offer like i said sammy and i are going to be doing that the, the opening weekend and we're super stoked for it so definitely if you want to get a more behind the scenes look at what it takes to put on not scary farm especially what it takes to build these mazes the history of the event and whatnot uh how it takes to come to get the scare zones all together you know i don't know what they'll talk about but it's going to be a lot of fun definitely buy that if you're a diehard not scary farm fan you're not going to want it you're not going to regret that yeah i i agree with tony it's i i'm really excited about this i know i've watched a few like behind the scenes tours that other uh channels have done on youtube and i was like dang this is really cool um and the fact that they're allowing the general public now to be able to do that is super awesome you can expect from us that we will be doing a review of it after we've been doing it if we're able to vlog um take some pictures we'll definitely share those on the channel as well yeah. um but Overall, we were, I, this was probably the thing that I was most excited for this season because uh, we had heard rumors and, and murmurings that Knotts was gearing up to do something uh, a little bit different this season. And then once those tickets came on sale, I immediately shot Tony a text and was like, hey, bro, we're getting these tickets. Like, this is the time we're doing. Let's go. Um, and Tony's like, yeah, let, I'm game. Let's do yeah. it. So um, it's definitely I think it's going to be well worth the $80. The fact that you got three hours, someone taking you through lights on tours. Uh, sharing the history of the event as well as some like little easter eggs in there so like fingers crossed uh we'll be able to go through origins because that would be the one that would be the, mean the most to me i would love um, to go through bloodline after seeing it yeah yeah definitely i mean any, any mazes we get to go through we'll be real ecstatic about yeah. like origins for me just because there's so much history displayed in that maze um that i definitely think that would I, that would be worth the 80 dollars alone if you told me hey you got 45 minutes with someone guiding you through uh, origins count me up sign me in and then the fact that we might get some other mazes uh done done deal uh, it's big, so uh, it's a fun time man i'm excited for yeah, it yeah definitely so we'll, we'll definitely like uh um this thing is a good reminder to go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit that bell notification um so that you can be aware when we do post that um and you'll be able to get a a, a review of it i don't know how sold these tickets are at this point um but i imagine that they are going to be selling out quick so yeah we do recommend you get that this as soon tour as possible. As, possible. Yeah, as <laughs> yeah. soon as possible. Another one that you're going to want to get as soon as possible as an add-on to your uh, whatever ticket you decide to uh, get as far as add-ons go. Um, something that me and Sammy can talk about on a personal experience because we had a great time with it last year is the buffet with the early entry. Now this, I guarantee you, if you're going on a very busy night, is your the best bang for your buck. Because not only do you get fed at the buffet, which has tons of delicious food, but you get to get in uh, about an hour early to hit the back four mazes in Gypsy Camp. That helps a ton, especially if, uh, like I said, you're going on a very busy night towards the end of the season and it's going to be crowded. This will get you four out of the way and then you can just focus on the ones that are inside the park um, and you should get through them no problem. But the buffet alone, 
Sammy and I finally got to do it last year. We talked about doing it in 2019, and we finally got to do it last year. And I would say uh, 10 out of 10 recommend. Uh, you get to have delicious food. I mean, they, there's a wide variety of food that's really good. Uh, you get a sipper cup that gets free refills for the entire night. And you get to do it with monsters. Like, it is so cool to do this whole experience with, you know, having the buffet and then the monsters are interacting with you as you're eating. It's amazing. It, it's a great time. And I highly recommend it. it you know, I mean, Sammy, what, I mean, you had a, just as good an experience that I had. Yeah, yeah, definitely. This this is worth the price of admission. I'll tell you what, um, the fact that you get food, um, that's a big dub because uh, especially if you're going to be there, uh, it's going to be a long night. So the fact that you can you know stuff up, get some calories in the body, that's a check for me. Right. Uh, the sipper cup, great check, free refills all night. That's a big dub. I drink a lot of fluids. Um, so it's definitely going to save me a few bucks. And, and I believe the sipper cup alone is like 15 to $20. I don't right. know off the t- top of my head. Um, so it's worth it for that. Um, and then you get some really personalized experience with the monsters because the monsters are there to cause some chaos and have some good times. Um, I will, I will say this. Don't ask any, don't ask the monsters to sing happy birthday to you. Um, cause they're not going to, and they're going to embarrass you. Um, so <laughs> It's funny. So if you want to mess with someone, you know, maybe say it's their birthday, but uh, just be aware for that. But th- yeah, this is going to, oh, the, the Super Cup is $17. I, I can see it here on the website now. Is it? Um, yeah, it's 17 I knew it was fi- somewhere between 15 and 20 Um, So right not right on almost in the middle. Um, But uh, yeah, it's a good time, good food, uh, good uh, personalized interactions. And the fact that you get a, basically another hour of Scary Farm is a, is a big dub, especially because... I believe Bloodline should be one of the uh, mazes you'll be able to go through. Yeah, uh, Bloodline and, um, and that line is going to be uh, a bit crazy. I can promise you that. Um, yep. Having gone through Special Ops Infected and going multiple times in 2019, that line can get anywhere to like three hours. Um, and so if you can get it done in probably 20, 30 minutes, that's going to save you a lot of time. Um, as well as you'll be able to go through the depths, uh, waxworks, and dark entities. So yeah. you might be able to have, if you get the buffet, you might be able to have everything bun- done by like 7.15, 7.30. Yep. Um, um, so we, we definitely recommend that, especially if you're, if you're going to if you're gonna go all out on a ticket. Or, well, second all out. If you're going to go out and get the very important monster tour, uh, second option, uh, if you're getting the fright, uh, fright and Fast Lane combined with the buffet, you're going you're gonna to get through everything multiple times Quick. if you want yeah. um so but the buffet if you if you if you can only afford one add-on to the general admission ticket this is the one we recommend buffet because uh, you're going to get food you're going to get drinks all night you're going to be able to hit those uh back four mazes and gypsy camp yeah. um so uh it's it hits all the marks for us like um that, thankfully we get to go multiple times to scary farm throughout the season um but you know, we always try to include a buffet now, uh, especially after last season experiencing it for the first time. Yeah, um, it's something we 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 think uh, takes the experience from ten out of ten to fifteen out of ten. We purposely do not eat for the entire day just so we can come in and stuff ourselves at this place. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's a eat, mission statement. Yeah, eat, eat like if you are going to eat, like eat light during the day. Like yeah. you know, maybe maybe some snacks or some stay drinks, hydrated, but, obviously. But yeah, yeah, maybe some light snacks, some light drinks. But then once you get there, you know, go all out. Get three plates. Three yeah, plates minimum. Minimum. Hot Cheetos mac and cheese. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> uh, I'm going to talk a little bit about the parking. It's not too much of a thing. It's more, it's it start, It's $30 on the site, and it's just a little bit faster. I think you may save a little bit of money, too, buying it on the site, but it's a little bit faster to just go up to the turn, or to the ticket, to the parking booth, and just show them the, the barcode, and then you're on your way. So that's uh, highly recommend if you're trying to get through that line faster to uh, just have that ready. Uh, bought already so yeah uh the last thing we're going to talk about oh well they have the the obviously you can buy the not scary farm t-shirt too on the website save two dollars online it's just an exclusive t-shirt for the year of all the new mazes that are on that lineup for that year so uh if you guys are into collecting haunt t-shirts like that uh definitely recommend buying it right now online as you're buying your ticket because it says you save two dollars so money's money savers are money savers and sammy's a champ at saving money right there Always. Always. Uh, the last thing we're going to talk about, if you want to stay multiple nights or you're coming from out of state or whatnot, they have the Knott's Scary Farm Hotel packages, which start at $100 a night. Um, so that is a good time. Uh, I, I've never stayed at the Knott's 
hotel before um, because we live so damn close to the event. But uh, it basically goes as follows. Scream and dream with a not scary farm hotel package. Play late and stay just steps away from the park. Nightmares are guaranteed. So, I mean, that's always good. Like I said, if you're coming from out of town, if you live far and you're going to go multiple nights to the event like the entire weekend, uh, look at the knots packages. They may have some good deals right there. And, and I've heard nothing but good things about that hotel. So, and, and it's supposed to be going under a major remodel pretty soon. So, yeah, correct. It is going under a major remodel, uh, and it's going to make your life. It's going to make your uh, life a little bit better because yeah, it's literally uh, like probably a five minute walk. <laughs> walk. Yeah, yeah, it's a five minute walk. Just get out of the park, walk down, all you'll be in your hotel, to the marketplace, past Ghost Rider, past the employment center, and boom, there is the there she hotel. Is. Yeah, and it's uh, I, I um, if you're gonna if you're gonna be going um multiple nights maybe you're doing a, a whole weekend maybe you can grab a couple nights there and uh have a good time and i believe part of your hotel stay you do get the hotel buffet oh that's uh, cool um don't quote me on that but uh, that's the rumors i've heard yeah um so if you do get that part of the hotel fee or if it's a little bit it, I, I, it might be a discounted rate right. um that's really cool as well but those are all the tickets you need to know this year for not scary farm. I mean, they, there's a lot of great options for you guys to, to make your night even better or more your experience, a memorable one. Um, I know that Sammy and I are, are doing a couple of these, uh, you know, throughout the season, of course, we're going to probably do buffet multiple times. Cause, uh, I know we usually do it for Rob's birthday and we're doing it, uh, opening, uh, that opening Friday weekend. And, um, you know we're gonna you know we're doing the behind the fog tour so that's gonna be a lot of fun and then just being at the event is a lot of fun so we're very excited for this year but let us know what ticket you are gonna looking at purchasing if you want some more info about it of course check not scary farms website they'll have all you need to know about every ticket and the pricing and everything so make sure to to do that uh make sure to stay tuned because tomorrow we're gonna do a no before you go video uh following the game plan and a some other videos that we have for knots week it's it's officially knots week so we hope you guys enjoy it um but the no before you go is going to make sure that you have the easiest uh experience of, of going that you you're packed correctly that you're bringing the right things to the haunt and what new policies are into effect for the 2022 haunt season with all that being said my name's anthony i'm sam and we are the knights of horror we'll see you in the fog peace